always a rainbow within reach on animal So good to see you again. The rest of the gang is already here. Let's see what Pig is up to. Hi, Pig. What are you painting? Can you tell what it is? A green apple. That's right. Let's see if you can guess what my other paintings are. What's this? That's Mr. Frog. <laughs> yes. And what's this? Hmm. It looks like a green airplane. That's right. What's this one? That's a green pumpkin. They're usually orange, but I wanted to paint a green one. Did you notice something about all my paintings? Look again. I painted a green apple, Mr. Frog, a green airplane, and a green pumpkin. What do they all have in common? They're all green. That's right. Today, I'm only painting green things. Pig's paintings give me an idea. Let's make green our special color of the day. Pig, Fox, I'm going to show you a new way of painting. Ooh. Um, I don't see any paint brushes. That's right, Fox. We're not going to paint with paint brushes. Huh? Huh? We're going to paint with sponges. Ready to see what happens? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Do you want to start with blue paper or red paper? Blue, please. And I'll take red, please. Great. Now, pick up a sponge. Dip it in the yellow paint. <laughs> and start painting. Oh, 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 look. My paper is turning orange. Because red and yellow make orange. My paper is turning green! That's right! <gasps> Look how smooth it looks! I'm tapping my sponge. It looks rough, like, like rocks. 
smooth and rough are textures. Say it after me. Textures. Textures. I'm done. Me too. Let's hang up your paintings and look at them. What's something that's the same about your paintings? We both painted with sponges. That's right. What else? We both painted with yellow. Yes. And what's something different about your paintings? Mine came out green. And Pig's is orange. And my painting is rough, but Fox's is smooth. That's right. Now, what do we do when we're done painting? We go play. Uh-huh. But first... We clean up. Oh, right. That's right. Let's clean up together. Okay. okay. colors like the color green. Look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! It's story time! Yay! Get around, everyone! What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called A Very Busy Day. This story is about a little girl who spends the day with her mama. Let's see what happens. Let's begin. A Very Busy Day. Written by Chisanga Mukuka. Illustrated by El Marto. Designed by Christian Mokuba. Today is a very busy day. Mama and I have lots of things to do and see. We walk to the station and find people waiting in a line. Old people and young people, loud people and quiet people, all going to town. Through the taxi window, I see cars driving by. Fast cars and slow cars. Big cars and small cars. There are so many buildings in town. Tall ones and short ones, glass ones and brick ones, everywhere I look. Mama and I walk in and out of shops. Shops for clothes and shops for books, shops for bags and all sorts of things. Mama tries on some shoes. Red shoes and green shoes, high shoes and low shoes. Hello, bonjour, hola, jumbo. In a big store, we fill a cart with food. Boxes of cereals and sacks of fruit, bags of flour and bottles of juice. 
Mama shows me the toys and asks me to choose. There are soft toys and round toys, loud toys and fast toys. Today, we've bought lots of things. Bags of food and bags of clothes, a pair of shoes and even some treats. Back at home in our quiet house, I take out the special gift that Mama bought just for me. The End Thank you, Mr. Goose! Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, hello Mr. Mr. Frog. Frog. Would you all like to play in a band? Okay. Yeah. Yes. I'm ready. Well, this song is all about singing and playing along. I'll sing first and then you can join in. Here we go. I am the music man, I come from far away and I can play. What can you play? I play the ukulele. Yuka, yuka, ukulele, 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 yuka, yuka, ukulele, ukulele. What instrument shall we pick next? Maracas! Okay, when the time comes, pretend to shake your maracas. You too. with me. Thank you, Mr. Frog. And thank you for playing along, too. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Let's do the monkey dance. Yay! Yeah! yeah. yeah. There's a brand new dance. everything six times. Clap six times. Nod six times. Point six times. March six times. I knew I could count on you. You do the monkey dance. Hi there, 
Mr. Pig? Have you seen Mr. Goose? Yes, I have. He's drinking juice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey! Goose, juice! <laughs> Those words end with the same sound. Did you hear that? Goose, juice. You're right. They do end in the same sound. That means they rhyme. Here's some more words that rhyme. This is a goat standing in a boat. <laughs> That's so silly. Goat, boat. They rhyme. Here's a house. That's a home for a mouse. House, mouse. They rhyme. Look at this sink. It's the color pink. Sink, pink. They rhyme. You're good at this. Here's one more. What did Mr. Frog bake? It looks like a cake. That's right. Bake, cake. They rhyme. That was fun. And now we're done. Pig, you made a rhyme. Fun. Done. You're right. <laughs> Let's go make more rhymes. Yeah. And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye. Before we say hello again, we need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. A tisket, a tasket, a green and yellow basket. I wrote a letter to my love, and on the way I dropped. It. I dropped it. I dropped it. Yes, on the.